So Raquel Dent, as I mentioned, that's re as I mentioned, that's really the magic bullet contained in MI Pace One. It delivers calcium, phosphorus, and fluoride in this wonderful protein matrix. And what's wonderful about the design of it is that patients really don't have to be the best brushers to be able to have this product be effective because the Recaldent effectively penetrates biofilm, so plaque that's left behind by the patient who doesn't brush or floss uh, particularly well, or if they're losing their manual dexterity, which is something that we commonly see in our aging patient population. And then it binds to that surface, to the plaque biofilms, it binds to the enamel that it's on, and it begins to deliver these materials and make them available and allow for remineralization and repair. And what you end up getting is you get these extraordinary benefits. You get anti-caries, you get anti-sensitivity, you get a product that is protein-based, it's delivering the proteins that are commonly found in healthy plaque, you're putting it into the environment, and therefore you're able to potentially rebuild the enamel, and so you can prevent potential white spot lesions, or even I've seen in some instances with great discipline and patient diligence, I've seen white spot lesions heal over a period of time with repeated use and application. But also we have great anti-erosion benefits and I'll tell you what, I love these remineralization paste. I'm all about dental hacks. I'm all about figuring out ways to be able to make what we do common every day from the chair easier. And I have found that what is one of the reasons patients are non-compliant when it comes to whitening? Sensitivity. Sensitivity is the killer. Uh, they start doing that. You tell them to wear it for four or five hours, try to maximize exposure time. And commonly, uh, you'll get them back and say, oh, I couldn't do it. I couldn't bear it. My teeth got so sensitive. And so you recommend shortening the amount of time. And then you tell them, okay, Let's just try doing it for 30 minutes to an hour if you can. Um, but then they get frustrated because they're not seeing the, you know, the results fast enough. And so they sort of abandon ship. Interestingly, I read um, the number one reason that people abandon plan A is they have a plan B. Isn't that interesting? That when people don't have an option to go to, uh, there is no plan B. They're more likely to stay persistent and stick with plan A. And I feel that sometimes patients find that there's another way or maybe we can do something else or whatever and uh, they abandon ship too early. Well, using remineralization paste and toothpaste like MI Paste 1, here's how I tell my patients to go about the protocol. I will tell them to brush their teeth using this, spit, but don't rinse. Let, let some of the excess reside on the teeth. And then I will tell them to put their whitening gel right into their trays, their custom trays we've made for them, seat these trays, and then all the ingredients that are needed to prevent uh, sensitivity and to help the teeth stay healthy, they're already present in the MI Paste 1, and it's on the teeth. And so as the teeth are whitening, they've got the calcium and the phosphorus and the fluoride, and I find that their sensitivity becomes almost non-existent, and their compliance rate goes up, and they're very, very happy. So this is a great little adjunctive add-on to your whitening protocol if you're doing a, a bunch of whitening in your office.